Okay, so this is another poem, and this is a portrait poem. It's like the image poem, uh, but specifically of a person doing something. So I have examples here, but I'm not going to show you those. Those are too long to do by video, but I'll show you this one. This is The Test Taker by Robert Miltner, whom I have not heard of. Anyway, so this is a portrait of, I just pulled this picture off the web, so it's not of her, but uh, somebody taking a test. So let's look at the imagery on, on this poem, The Test Taker. Her eyebrows are phone lines, overcrowded. Dang it, starting again. Her eyebrows are phone lines, overloaded with crows. With two hands, she holds up her head, knowledge, or emptiness being that heavy. Her lips purse, teeth chew the skin that lines the mouth, jaws clench. Looking at the clock's face, she stares into the enemy's eye. Her convict eyes see through both the chaplain on death row and the executioner who knows she smells freedom from out in the hall. Just an image of a girl taking a test. I love this image right here. Her eyebrow, actually it's a metaphor, right? Her eyebrows are phone lines overloaded with crows. So her eyebrows are sort of a straight line and pushed down, overloaded with crows. What a cool image. See if you can do something like that. Put a metaphor in there. Show us an image through another image. With two hands, she holds up her head. I like. I think it's funny here. Knowledge or emptiness being that heavy, and then her her lips, how they're pursed, and she's clenching her jaw. And then she looks at the face of the clock, and she has only a certain amount of time. And it's like she's looking at the enemy. And then her convict eyes. She wants to be bad. She wants to be bad. She sees both through the chaplain and the executioner and she smells the freedom outside of the hall. This is a girl who wants to be out, not taking this test anymore. Cool poem. I like that. All right, so see what you can do. Think of, see, a, see an image in your mind of a person doing something. Maybe your mother gardening or maybe um, somebody doing the dishes or maybe somebody cooking or yeah, it doesn't have to be a parent. Maybe it's your friend trying to flirt. That would be funny. Uh, what else could you do? Your teacher doing something. Don't go for me, please. Uh, what else could you do? Maybe a construction worker. We've got construction going on on campus. Look out the one eye and see what a construction worker is doing. Just an image of somebody doing something, a person. Okay, good luck. You can do it.